What's up, everybody? This is IFBB Pro Cody Montgomery coming at you guys with another uh, video here on my YouTube channel. Uh, today we're going to be training some legs. I'm going to take you guys through what I did um, on this particular day. Getting back into trying to get basic and heavy again. Um, you know, trying to put on some some weight uh, in the next few weeks. So I'm, I'm going to definitely be. Uh, as you guys notice in the workouts, uh, trying to push a little bit more weight than I have been in the past few weeks, and uh, you know just try to rebound from this uh, deload phase I took uh, from as far as weight training and from the diet. So, first exercise that we are going to be doing is leg extensions. As you guys already saw, um, we started with a good number of sets, like four to five sets on there. Um, you know, working our way up uh, in weight, obviously. Uh, and uh, we went on for the, our second exercise. We did a uh, seated leg curl. Um, this is one of my, uh, you know, not favorite exercises to, to start with, but it's a little bit of a different exercise. So uh, I, I like to throw it in at the beginning today, um, just to kind of throw some variety at my at my body. And and this is going to be an overall, you know, workout as far as uh, both quads and hams and. You know, this is a good way to, to of course, leg extensions to uh, push some blood into your quads and um, seated leg curls gets a little bit of blood into your hamstring. Get your legs warmed up, and then uh, we worked into um, leg press. Um, on that, we did, uh, you know, we worked our way up to uh, a heavy set of uh, 10 reps, um, you know, kind of working our way up slowly, kind of feeling each set. Um, you know, at this uh, particular day, like I said, I was trying to push it a little bit, so, you know, I got um, a little heavy, um, heavier than I have been in the, in the past few days, made it a point to, to try to kind of shock my legs a little bit today, um, work our way up to 10, 10 reps on here, um, just try to, try to keep a focus on feeling the muscle out um, on all these exercises, but especially leg press, a lot of people uh, have a tendency to just throw around weight, and, you know, even me. Um, I definitely uh, have to have to really, you know, try to get that mind and muscle connection to really have my legs respond. Um, you know, in the past, my legs have been, you know, one of my weaker body parts, so I've really had to adapt um, my training styles and what I do kind of in the gym for them. Um, you know, as my career's uh, progressed and uh, my body has uh, responded well, and I continue to try to learn. Uh, pushed uh, different things at it as you guys will see on my channel um, if you guys haven't already you should, guys should subscribe to my channel so you guys can see more videos like this um, I hope you guys you know enjoy are enjoying the content so as you guys see here we worked our way up to and this is going to be my last uh, set so this is the, the hard set of 10 worked my way up slow I think I did a total of like four or five sets uh, in total I think five um, you know, just working my way up and then feel like, you know, you got to go um, really heavy, really quick. You know, I really uh, I think uh, warming up is crucial. Um, so then our fourth exercise um, was a hammer leg press. Uh, we did three to four sets on there. Me, I, actually, I did four, um, four sets, 15 reps um, was what I was trying for um, pretty much on each set of that. And as you see, Roland is... Um, there telling me to slow down and feel out my reps which uh, all you guys should do during this workout um, this one I in particular really tried to uh, to feel it you know this this point in the workout you just hit another leg press so your legs are pretty pumped um, going to another leg press like this it just throws a different angle at it and uh, you know I actually really liked it um, going a little higher rep on here um, you know I was gonna originally go at, for 20 reps but my legs were pretty damn pumped so I was uh, fine with uh, sets of 15 for today. Working my way up uh, progressively on this one as well. Um, I have a tendency to do that on a lot of my uh, training days just to, you know, of course, warm up the muscle and start pushing the weight and then get to a, to a max set. Uh, I think that's a really weight, good way to uh, you know, be able to push optimal weight with uh, perfect form. So the next exercise that you guys are about to see is we're going to do a uh, straight leg um, on the uh, the hack squat, and this is a this is another good one um, to kind of throw in there to change it up. You know, I do a lot of uh, barbell uh, stiff leg and and even a lot of dumbbell stiff leg, but this is another one I just like to throw in there. And uh, we worked our way up um, 
and we just did pretty much um, four sets on there, um, 12 reps, and just uh, really tried to focus on getting a good stretch and working the hamstring from the, the stretch position. Um, of course, on this one, you guys want to um, be careful and, and uh, keep your back um, out of it as much as you can. Try to feel it really in your hamstrings and your glutes. Um, you know, stick your butt out and uh, keep your uh, keep your chest and and uh, head in a good position as far as um, not improvising your neck and uh, putting a lot of tension on your lower back. So just be careful on that one. That is a little bit of a one. It depends on your hack squat and things like that on, as far as uh, how you can set it up. Then. Uh, our next exercise we went into, and by this point, you know, my legs were pretty uh, fried. As I previously said, I have been on a deload phase, so this, this workout was uh, definitely pushed me, and I uh, hope it will push you guys. Um, we did a single leg curl. Um, we did three sets here. Just uh, nothing crazy. We didn't go super heavy with weight. I was just really uh, trying to feel the exercise, and, you know, like I said, my, my legs were pretty pumped up at this point. And, you know, I was really just going for, you know, an overall pump and, uh, you know, just try to feel it out. On these, I like to, to try to think about at the top of the movement, trying to stop the weight um, from actually moving um, for, you know, even if it's a split second or a, a second hold, um, you know, the contraction that you're going to get out of that and uh, the actual um, amount of muscle recruitment, uh, muscle fiber recruitment. Um, during this uh, compared to just you know throwing around the weight is a lot more you know obviously um, as you go heavier you should try to get a little bit more explosive with uh, with your reps and that's going to recruit a lot more uh, muscle fiber as well so we this is a long workout so bear with me um, exercise seven is uh, we did some adductors um, just high rep here and you know, I really like these to, to help fill out the leg and get overall thickness um, you know, you can't just uh, go up to down. You got to think about you know the sides and, and everything. It's a it's a you know you want a round muscle and you want a full um, you know complete leg. So this is uh, this is really good to help you know, fill out the thigh. And then we finish it off. Like I said, getting back into uh, some heavy weights. So I wanted to you know finish with squats. Of course, not feeling uh, my super strongest right now, but. Uh, you know, just try to uh, feel it out and get get up to a good set of uh, 10 where I really felt, um, you know, like I was pushing myself. Uh, you know, obviously not to like a, a failure, but pretty pretty close. At this point in the workout, you know, your, your back's fatigued, your legs are fatigued, everything's, you know, feeling it. So, you know, doing squats last is going to definitely make it a challenge. Um, but who doesn't like a challenge? So... That's why I threw them in there last. You know, of course, you can't do as much weight as if you are uh, starting to work out, but you get a lot more out of it, I think, and it's a lot safer because, like I said, you don't have to go as heavy, so you don't uh, risk you know, injuries. So, as you guys see, I, I worked my way up to a good set of 405, and it felt good. And uh, you know, hopefully next week I'll be back with uh, with some more weight on the bar. So that's the that's the plan. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, the workout footage. Uh, Go try this workout for yourself. Um, you know, of course, tag me on uh, you know, the social medias if you guys uh, try out the workout and let me know how you guys like it. And uh, I really do appreciate you guys tuning in. And I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. And until the next one, God bless.